My name is Patricia Craigsman, and I'm a teacher librarian at a model school in the Toronto District School Board. Today, I'm going to be talking about diversity in the classroom library. Students need to see themselves in your classroom library. We know that discrimination is intrinsically linked to being diverse. Whether that diversity is in race, ethnicity, religious beliefs, gender, expression, language, and economic or social experiences. A diverse classroom library seeks to normalize this. How will you do this? First, consider what diversity means to you as an educator. If you don't know, devote time to thinking and researching your position. Do an amount of work that is equal to the value diversity has to you. If you aren't doing the work, you need to question why. And know as an educator that this work is ongoing. Next, look at the demographic of your school community and your classroom. Who are you serving? Why? Let those students who you are serving dictate the titles you will mirror back to them. Your classroom library needs to look like your classroom community. Next, consider reading older books and thinking about who benefits from a certain title, whose voice is missing, whose voice is being empowered, and how can this title create a better and more diverse society for our students. Only bring new titles in that serves diversity and has a purpose in your classroom library. Consider the difference between empowerment and a change maker and tokenism. For example, don't just pull titles for Lunar New Year, keep them out so your Asian identifying students see themselves all the time. Try to purchase from Black, Indigenous, or POC owned and focused vendors. How will you know if you're doing a good job? Your students will tell you.